Bertilton. And here we are again. Yay. Bob and Maria. Hello, beautiful lady. Hello, handsome man. <laughs> See, we just speak these words of faith, hope, and love. Encouragement. Into each other's life. Yes. I told you a while ago, I said, you know, I love it when you, you uh, speak uh, words of faith yes. to me. I love words of faith. You said, we shall have our new home. Yes. We shall have new furniture. Yes. We shall have a beautiful lot. Yes. The, the, the desires of our heart. That's right. And I, I mean, feel you have so to, excited. You have, you have to speak it, you know. To, to, to bring it into, to, to re actually, it's the keys mm -hmm. of releasing mm -hmm. yes. things mm -hmm. unseen mm -hmm. into the seen realm. We have, to, we have to release them. Absolutely. That we have the keys. Right. And, it, and if you don't speak them, then, you know, it, it's useless. I mean, you have to believe it with all your heart and all your being and, you know, childlike faith, you know. Now, those of you that are watching with us today, we have an hour broadcast, uh, but we do it in two halves, mm -hmm. two 30 minutes, which yes. will play on our wonderful WFBN network. And you can go to your app store and get the app on your whatever phone or smart TV you have. And uh, we're just all over the place. That's right. And just watch it. It's fun. It's good. It's good words. You know, I mean, who, want, who wants to watch the garbage that's on TV right now? Nobody. I mean, you know, tune on WFBN and you get great, you know, inspiring words that feed your soul. Uh-huh. And man shall not live by natural bread alone. Absolutely. But by every yes. word that proceeds out of the mouth of God. Yes. I remind, and, and <clears throat> Maria and I, we live by faith. Yes. Yes. And not by sight. Yes, that's an understatement. <laughs> yes. And if we're going to live, mm -hmm. it's going to have to be by our faith. Absolutely. And not our natural, mm -hmm. uh, natural abilities. Mm -hmm. We can live through natural abilities and means. Right. But that doesn't seem to be the path that the Lord takes us down. That's right. We have the if we want to have a victorious, beautiful life. Mm -hmm. It's going to have to be a life of the God kind of faith. Yes. What What other way is there to live, though? I, I mean, I don't, I, mean there, <laughs> I don't know another one. There isn't any. I mean, that is the way to live. I mean, that's why we're here, you know, to serve him. I mean, that's why he breathed life into all of us was so that we could live by faith and, you know, speak his word to other people and always, you know, give our testimony about how great he is. I mean, well, what what other reason? Well, I mean, to just collect things and have stuff. And I mean, I, I would think that would be the purpose of people's lives. Well, Jesus said the thief comes to steal, kill and destroy. But I've come that you might have life and have it abundantly. Mm -hmm. So the abundant life mm -hmm. in Christ yes. is a life of faith. Yes. That the, the God kind of faith mm -hmm. is where it is what releases the abundance mm -hmm. Absolutely. of heaven's resources right. into our life. Right. And abundance is a broad word because abundance does not necessarily have to mean material things. Abundance right. is health. Abundance is joy. You know, joy's huge. You know, how many people have so much abundance and they're miserable? They, and just they, unhappy. They just don't like their life. They they see the the cup half you know, uh, ha, ha, instead of half full, half empty. You know, they just have a very you know negative way of living their life. Well, so I think that joy is huge in abundance. You know, I I love it. Mm -hmm. I I I I just I tell the Lord twenty four hours a day how much I enjoy finding out more mm -hmm. about him and mm -hmm. the glories of his riches mm -hmm. that are in us. Yes. That abundant life, yes. the rich life yes. in Christ. Yes. But I feel that joy is, I think the joy of the Lord is our strength. You know, I mean, how epic is the joy of the Lord for, for us, you know, that we were joyful, you know, I mean, like uh, yesterday was Valentine's right. And, um, the girls wrote us cards oh, and remember yeah. and uh rebecca writes you know the joy of bob and i you know our family i mean that's huge that you know a 15 year old would think that her parents are joyous you know and and joy is huge i mean i think that's very abundant you know when you talk about you know his abundance you know faith and our, you know what we get you know for abundantly I'd say joy is number one. Well, and Elijah said she thanked us, mommy and daddy, 
for meeting all of my needs. Yes. Isn't that right. something well, thanking us for well, supplying I mean, our, our and needs? And I, I would say that those letters that they wrote to us and those cards were like Jesus, you know? I mean, that's what we have to, you know, when we're journaling or when we're thinking or when we're, you know, just going through the day, thank the Lord for all that he supplies every single day. You, you know, you wake up. You know, and you, you're breathing and you're out and the sun's shining. And, you know, I mean, I'm so joyful and thankful. And and that doesn't come from me. That's Jesus living on the inside okay. of me. Okay, okay. You know? So outwardly, things right. could be totally different. Absolutely. But inwardly. Right. Well, him, it, I mean, he's the spirit that just makes me joyful. Mm -hmm. No matter what my circumstances mm -hmm. are, you mm -hmm. know, it's the joy of the Lord inside of me. Mm -hmm. And the more I meditate on his word and the more I read his scriptures and the more I listen to good things and the more I watch WFBN and all the great pastors on there, they feed my soul. Mm -hmm. And so I don't look at, you know, the natural, the world, the way things are. I look at it through the lens of Jesus Christ living on the inside mm -hmm, of me. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Looking through the lens of Christ. Yes, absolutely. Faith. I mean, the, the abundant life is a life of faith. Yes. Walk by faith and not right. by... The abundance right. of Christ, Yes. of joy and mm -hmm, peace, mm -hmm. is resident. You know, the, the you that's in you. Yes. Well, the hidden know, man of the heart, the right, Christ right, in us. Right, right. So, you know, we all, like what we were talking about yesterday, you know, people talk, you know, a lot of, you know, certain religions, they are very, they, they base, uh, you know, their Christianity on the crucifixion, where we should start basing, and I think it's more of the resurrection. It begins with the crucifixion. It begins with the crucifixion, but they're stuck there, you know, you know, it's all about, you know, to me, it should be about the resurrection, and, you know, and... And us, we should speak like we're resurrected with Christ. So what's coming out of our mouth is either resurrection or crucifixion. Mm -hmm. You know, when you're going back to your mistakes and your sins and oh, and this, I mean, you're still in the crucifixion. You know, you, we have to talk resurrec resurrection, mm -hmm. healing, prosperity, you know, joy, you know, all the great things that, that, that he blesses us mm -hmm. with. Mm -hmm. Well, we're, uh, uh, yesterday, mm -hmm. you know, I did uh, several shows yesterday, three, and in one, a new podcast, by the way, those of you that, that uh, want to follow uh, Robert Tilton today on uh, Spotify and uh, Anchor, and then we've applied for Apple and Google. Mm -hmm. So, uh, but we have a, I, I have a burst of inspiration. I immediately turn on my audio on my phone and post it so you can get a fresh word right then and there, mm -hmm. uh, speaking by divine inspiration. Uh, uh, James 1 says faith mm -hmm. and I was talking yesterday and, and, and honey, you and I uh, search the scriptures mm -hmm. so that we can find mm -hmm. our salvation and our life, mm -hmm. our health, mm -hmm. our joy, our peace, mm -hmm. our divine provision, mm -hmm. and for our daily bread. Mm -hmm. That uh, we we know that uh, it's not natural bread that feeds us, mm -hmm. though we eat physical natural bread. Yes. Uh, but it's spiritual bread mm -hmm. that feeds us, mm -hmm. that gives us the ability to convert. The spiritual bread gives us the ability to convert our spiritual words and faith into material substance. Yes, absolutely. And, you know, uh, the, and this is important to me and mm -hmm. us mm -hmm. as a family mm -hmm. and a ministry. Mm -hmm. And we are feeding, not only are we feeding ourselves, mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. but we're feeding our mm -hmm. beautiful partners and friends and those that are watching us on today's mm -hmm. broadcast, Amen. either live mm -hmm. or somewhere in the world. Mm -hmm. And we get people from all over the world respond to us. But the disciples came to Jesus and I'm, I'm all ears. Mm -hmm. And they were concerned about their food Mm -hmm. their clothing, mm -hmm. their shelter, mm -hmm. their needs being met. Yes. And they, they, they said, we, we have need of these things. How, mm -hmm. how does God supply these things? Mm -hmm. And I won't read it, but I'll just kind of paraphrase it. 
And Jesus said, well, your father knows you have need mm -hmm. of these things. Mm -hmm. So that refreshes me. Like mm -hmm. that scripture you got mm -hmm. when the, Jesus said he saw Nathaniel yeah. under the tree. Yeah, I see you. I, I saw, saw you. I saw you. Mm -hmm. See, he sees us mm -hmm. and he sees what we need. Mm -hmm. When always, we need it, always. even before we call, mm -hmm. he's already provided mm -hmm. an answer. Mm -hmm. Glory to God. Yes, absolutely. Woo, I like yes, that. Yes. Before we call, he's mm -hmm. already, he knows what mm -hmm. we need mm -hmm. before we call. Mm -hmm. And he already has the supply waiting on us mm -hmm. to ask in faith, mm -hmm. nothing wavering. Yes. Mm. yes. In all areas of our life. Absolutely. But the part I, I want to get to, he's, he, he, and Jesus said, well, Look at the lilies of the field. Mm -hmm. Solomon in all mm -hmm. of his glory mm -hmm. was not as clothed as beautiful as they are. Absolutely. They don't toil. They don't spin. Mm -hmm. They don't sow. They don't reap. They don't mm -hmm. put in barns. Mm -hmm. But look what God did for them. How much more Lord. will your heavenly father give me. good things unto those that would ask you? Amen. Yes. So it tells me that good things are available for the asking. Yes, absolutely. They're already there. I think he already knows what we want. He said if we'd be willing you know? and obedient, we would eat the good and eat. Mm -hmm. We're talking about eating today. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Food. Yes. The willing and obedient would eat the good and mm -hmm. the fat of the, the willing and obedient. Yes. Sometimes children are willing but not obedient. Yes. Sometimes they're obedient but not, not very willing. willing. Right. But willing and, and obedient, obedient will eat right. the good and the fat well, of the look, land. I mean, look at us. I mean, when we were uh, living in California, right? I mean, when we were Santa Barbara, right? County. When we were facing what we were facing at that time. Yeah. Who at that moment would you have ever thought? Fast forward two and a half years later, that we would be sitting here, that you would have a network. That we would have I'm watching you on the television. that we would have, you know, a house, you know, in Florida with all the craziness on a lake. No, with all with all that's going with with all that's going on in real estate in Florida. I mean, everyone's decided to move to Florida, you know, that we have a house here <laughs> and we came before you know, anybody else and we have a four year lease, yeah. you know, I mean, you know, that's pretty epic. Well, somebody said, well, it's not your home. Well, it's ours right now. Well, that's, that's, <laughs> it's perfect for us right now because yeah. until this, we build this is, this in is, Jesus name, a this dream is home. the season of, of where we're at right Preparation. now. Preparation. Exactly. Prepara preparing. Yeah. Yes. And I mean, when you think of all that, and I remember being in California and to Only me, at home. no, and to me, the thought of moving, a little ranch. No, the thought of moving across the country oh, and wow. starting over again was just so overwhelming, yeah. you know, and the way the Lord just <clears throat> everything, you know, play, everything turned out the way he wanted it to turn out and the way we wanted it to turn out. Mm -hmm. So, I mean, it's just incredible. I mean, so the Lord is our shepherd and thy shall not want, you know, what we talked about last week. And that well, is we very, have very to true. fill the water pots. We had run out of wine. Mm -hmm at the wedding mm -hmm. and they needed more wine. Mm -hmm. And for some reason, the disciples came to Jesus mm -hmm. to get some more wine. Mm -hmm. Interesting. Mm -hmm. And, and, uh, Mary, the mother, Jesus said, do whatever the Lord tells how, how, what, however God's the Lord speaks to you, whatever he tells you to do mm -hmm. the secret to getting what you want is doing it. Yes. Cause faith without works is dead. Mm -hmm. And so that tells me, Faith that works is not faith. That's right. That's right. And unless faith inspires to right. action. Well, right. And, well, wait, unless faith inspires to action. Right. Well, and motivates yeah. us. Well, it's like if we, we would have been in California and, you know, you and I have all the faith in the world. I mean, we, we do. We do. We talk We need it. all the faith we in the world. We walk it. We live it. We, I mean, you and I, I mean, that's, that's us. We you fight know? the fight of faith. Yes. But I mean, we could have had all the faith and just said, no, we're not doing this. We're not, you know. We're not going to move. It's COVID. Uh, you know, we're not going to find, you know, this. Let's just stay where we are. You know, we have everything here. Yeah, we had Pharaoh's army behind us too. Yeah, I know that. But I'm just saying that if we wouldn't have had faith with works, we wouldn't have ended up here. Well, you know? our faith motivated us. Our mm -hmm. faith, mm -hmm. faith from what we knew mm -hmm. from the word. Yes. Faith comes by hearing. Jesus mm -hmm. is telling the disciples how to get their mm -hmm. needs met. Mm -hmm. 
food, shelter, clothing, mm-hmm. including mm-hmm. the desires of our heart. Yes. And he says, here's the secret to success. Yes. Absolutely. In life, yes. Seek first the kingdom of, the God. Kingdom of God. Yes. Because Jesus went about mm-hmm. having a healing ministry, teaching mm-hmm. ministry, mm-hmm. and preaching ministry. Yes. Preaching the gospel of the kingdom. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. This is very important because yes. in the prayer that He taught us to pray, the Lord's prayer, our Father, mm-hmm. He's our Father, mm-hmm. which art in heaven, mm-hmm. spiritual Father. Holy is thy name, mm-hmm. worshiping him. Mm-hmm. Holy, 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 Lord God Almighty. Holy, worshiping him. I got that. I didn't mm-hmm. mean that. And, and seeking first the kingdom of God. Mm-hmm. Okay? Mm-hmm. And, and so the, 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 it's all within the kingdom. And, and uh, from the j- days of John the Baptist until now, the kingdom has been preached mm-hmm. and multitudes are pressing in yes. to the benefits. Yes. And Jesus said the kingdom has come nigh you. Mm-hmm. Or in other words, the kingdom of God has come, mm-hmm. but not with observation, low here, though there. The kingdom of God and its riches and its glory and its abundance mm. is resident inside of us. Amen. Yes. I have. A, yes. Okay. Absolutely. My yes. God supplies all your need according to his riches and glory, the mm-hmm. riches of his glory yes. within the kingdom of God. Yes. yes. And Jesus said the kingdom is nigh. The kingdom has come. Mm-hmm. And he brought the health of the kingdom mm-hmm. by healing the mm-hmm. sick. Mm-hmm. He brought the abundance of the Amen. kingdom by multiplying the loaves yes. and fishes. Yes. He brought the power and the purpose of the kingdom by stealing, stealing the storms of life. Yes. Yes. So we now are understanding that our faith. Mm-hmm gives us the supernatural strength and ability Mm -hmm. to enter into the blessings and the benefits and the bounty of the kingdom. Yes. And, and, and Jesus said, some of you standing here will not see death until you see the kingdom of God come with power. Hmm. So the kingdom has come with power. Holy spirit, day Mm -hmm. of Pentecost has Mm -hmm. come with power. Yes. So we're in So Jesus is telling us, seek the kingdom Mm -hmm. first. Yes. Understand the laws of the principles of the kingdom, the will of the kingdom. And then here's the biggie. Now the next phase is to learn about his righteousness. Mm -hmm. And that brings us into our position Mm -hmm. and our identification Mm -hmm. in Christ's sacrificial lamb at Calvary, Mm -hmm. crucifixion, Mm -hmm. then our resurrection Mm -hmm. up with him. And now we're seated, identifying Mm -hmm. with seated with him Mm -hmm. in a heavenly, heavenly position Mm -hmm. in power and purpose. Yes. Glory to God. I mean, that, that, that's incredible. I mean, that's huge. He's telling us that's what will feed us that revelation. Yes. Yes. That's, that's now how with, with, by believing it, you Uh know, by acting on it, you know, by doing it. You know, by unwavering faith, Mm -hmm. you know, like, you know, where you're, that is all that you see, you know, you, you, you can't be double minded, you know, you can't be doing, you know, reading it and then saying something else. Now here's a, here's a thought because we're talking today about how Bob and Maria get their needs met. (laughs) We're talking to them today about how Bob and Maria eat and pay our bills. Mm Mm-hmm. Right? Mm -hmm. I mean, isn't this where we live right Mm -hmm. here? In other words, slicing and dicing and getting right, drilling down into Mm -hmm. the the, the, the power uh, of God and the residence of Christ's abundant life within us. Yes. Christ is rich in you. Yes. But you must renew your mind Mm -hmm. and release him Mm -hmm. by believing in your heart through words of faith. faith. Yes. So. So now I'm, I'm, I'm focused on this thing, honey, because I've got great aspirations for us and the family and the ministry Mm -hmm. and our partners. Mm -hmm. I see our partners absolutely the most happiest, successful, inspired, motivated, healthy partners, ministers of reconciliation on the planet. Yes. I see us releasing mm-hmm. them into the bounty of the kingdom, into the blessings of Oh, the blessings of Abraham in your home and life. I see our partners prospering mm-hmm. like us. Yes. If we have a new home, the way we get it, they get a new home. Mm-hmm. We get a new car, they get a new car. Mm-hmm. We get new clothes, 
they know how to get new clothes. Mm -hmm. So we're talking about mm -hmm. getting new clothes out of Matthew 6, mm -hmm. seeking first that the kingdom has come. Yes. The kingdom is resident on the inside of us. Mm -hmm. That we have to press into those things. Mm -hmm. The woman with the issue of blood, 12 years, she heard the truth. Yes. She heard the word. The word gave her faith mm -hmm. to overcome that sickness, that plague, the incurable disease. She spoke and released her words with faith and action. Mm -hmm. she, was not, she was not a hear only, mm -hmm. which is not faith. Right. Faith without works is dead. Mm -hmm. So you say you have faith, but if you don't have works, you don't have faith. Right. Because yeah. faith, if you have Bible faith, it will motivate you and inspire you to action, mm -hmm. to works. Right. But it, you know, it's you a have renewal. to have works. It's a renewal of your mind completely. We come here, we built this studio, mm -hmm. we hauled these boards in here, did a lot of grunt mm -hmm. stuff that mm -hmm. no one would ever think that we did. Mm -hmm. In spite of it a little humiliating and humbling, but we did it. We yeah. still do Look it today. Look how nice it is. It's, it's, it's fantastic. It's beautiful. It's just mm -hmm. the beginning of what I see mm -hmm. in our dreams and visions with mm -hmm. faith, with works. Mm -hmm. And we're working our faith. Yes. Now, I want to read this. This is very important because I've got this thing going on. Because the disciples, how much time do we have, Victor? The disciples uh, came to Jesus and they said, Lord, increase our faith. Well, that's important because if it's faith that supplies our needs, mm -hmm. our housing, our food, our shelter, mm -hmm. our clothes, mm -hmm. our rent, our electricity, mm -hmm. our tuition, mm -hmm. college for the girls, mm -hmm. and you know, all the things. Weddings for the girls. Wed <laughs> well, let's don't get Those are that. all things that I, that I think about. <laughs> she, she does. She, she, she thinks about the college. Fast forward, she fast about, forward. She thinks about yeah. everything. Well, we had a miracle yesterday. There was something that we needed. Yes. For, I won't get into the detail, but there was something we needed for the girls at, in their, their school. Mm -hmm. And uh, it was expensive. Mm -hmm. And uh, and we just had to believe it in. And mm -hmm. it came in right, actually came in early. Mm -hmm. You know, a couple yes. of three days early. Mm -hmm. Supernatural. It's something that's really, really been on your mind mm -hmm. for several weeks. Mm -hmm. And it was supplied. Glory to yes, God. Yes, God supplies all our needs according to his riches and glory. And so... According to his riches Absolutely. and glory. Absolutely, yes, he does. The, the, according to the riches of his glory mm -hmm. within the kingdom, mm -hmm. and Christ is rich mm -hmm. on the inside of us, yes. and we have to let him out yes. through believing in our heart, through our Speaking, words, yeah. and through our actions. Yeah. So here's, i got to read this, because Victor's telling me it's short time. So the Lord said, they said, increase our faith. The Lord said, if you have faith as a mustard seed, mm. mustard seed faith, you can say to a mulberry tree, be pulled up into the roots of the planet of the sea, and it would obey you. So we're, words mm -hmm. of faith is authority. Mm -hmm. Yes, So the absolutely. tree, natural in the natural realm, mm -hmm. obeys us. But wait, and which of you here is having a servant? And I love this teaching. I first got this from Brother Copeland. Which of you having a servant, plowing or tending sheep, doing things? Will say to him, come in out of the field? But will he not rather say to him... Prepare something for my supper. So that's saying, mm -hmm. action, mm -hmm. doing it. Prepare something for supper. Gird her, yourself and serve me. So our faith serves us, serve me, till I have eaten and drinken, and afterward you will eat and drink. So we're talking about daily bread, mm -hmm. having things to eat. Mm -hmm. Having our pantries, our cupboards mm -hmm. filled with steak and food yeah. and so forth. Mm -hmm. And it's saying our faith. But wait, but daily bread, I, I think too, is the word of God. That's our daily bread too. I, I see that as a, our spiritual daily bread to get us our daily bread. You know? So the spiritual mm -hmm. bread mm -hmm. produces the material bread. bread. Mm -hmm. Well, that makes sense. The mm -hmm. woman was the woman uh, in First Kings seventeen was starving to death. Mm -hmm. Her and her son, mm -hmm. they had no food, mm -hmm. a little water, mm -hmm. just a little meal in a barrel and a little oil. Mm -hmm. And the prophet said, "Fix me something to drink." Mm -hmm. to and eat. she said, it was, and, 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 "And then fix me a, bake me a cake to mm -hmm. eat." Mm -hmm. And she said, "I didn't have much." Yeah, but it didn't take much. It was right. she had mustard 
seed mm -hmm. faith yeah. to bake a cake for right. the prophet of God. Yes. And when she did, mm -hmm. it, it multiplied. Huh? It multiplies. It multiplied. So yeah. the word mm -hmm. that Elijah spoke, mm -hmm. or the word the Lord is the actual scriptural, the word the Lord spoke through Elijah, mm -hmm. she believed it, mm -hmm. she had works, faith with works. Yes, amen. And it fed her. Amen, good preaching, yes, very good. Right? Yes. So she heard the word, mm -hmm. she believed it, mm -hmm. she acted on it, acted on it mm -hmm. in spite of mm -hmm. how things looked in the natural, because mm -hmm. God chose the weak things to mm -hmm. confound the wise, mm -hmm. the things which are not to bring, mm -hmm. to, the things which are not to bring to naught the things that are, That's to right. bring, we could take, remove things or bring things into existence mm -hmm. and faith serves us. Mm -hmm. And if we will feed our faith, mm -hmm. our faith will feed us. Yes. Faith serves us when we serve faith. When, mm -hmm. we, when we're just so into faith, you mm -hmm. know? So seeking first the kingdom of God, keys to the kingdom to release the potential, to unlock the potential of the kingdom mm -hmm. of God inside of us. Yes. Keys, words, authority, mm -hmm. spiritual food mm -hmm. releases the potential, mm -hmm. unlocks mm -hmm unlocks and mm -hmm. releases mm -hmm. the abundance of the mm -hmm. kingdom of heaven. Amen. Yes. I believe Jacob saw that. Yes. When he saw heaven open. Mm -hmm. I believe he saw it. Mm -hmm. I believe he, when he saw heaven, Jesus at the top of the, mm -hmm. of the ladder, and he saw the angels bringing the blessings of heaven mm -hmm. down and the answers to prayer. Mm -hmm. Your father knows we have need of these things. Mm -hmm. Let's pray. Father, in the name of Jesus, you see the saints that are watching us today our partners, our supporters. Amen. Father, you said just as Jacob saw heaven open, he vowed to tithe. I believe there are people today, Lord, that will help support our ministry and fix us something to eat. Fix you something to eat, Jesus, so that we can continue to bless your people. In Jesus' name, amen. 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 We love you. Bob and Maria Tilton, reaching, reaching out, out to, to you. you.